Greetings demons and welcome to a follow-up to a video that I did a few days ago talking about the UEFA Fortnite Cup where basically we have got a bunch of new information because of the fact that Fortnite have actually tweeted about it and also made a blog post and uh, yeah. So it all started with a tweet from Fortnite basically saying that the Icon series kicks into full gear with two of soccer's finest, Harry Kane and Marco Reyes are coming to the island to see when these two stars are arriving and get some details on the Fortnite UEFA Euro 2020 Cup where cash prizes are on the line. And they then linked a blog post which I'm going to read from because I think it's important to get the information out as clearly as possible and it's there, it's written out, I might as well read from there. The Icon series kicks into full gear this summer with two of football's finest, England national team captain Harry Kane and two-time German player of the year Marco Reyes joining a new squad, the Icon series. On June 11th at 8pm Eastern Time, both players' likenesses will be available as separate outfits or together in the Kane and Reyes bundle. So basically, at reset on the 11th of June or 12th, depending on your time zone, you'll be able to get either either skin individually or you'll actually be able to get them together. They have a few extra items with them, so I'll get into that. But yeah, honestly, really cool that they're doing it as a bundle. And generally, just, I'm a huge fan of both Kane and Reyes. I, you know, I've said a lot in many videos that, like, you know, I'm from the UK, obviously I'm, I'm British, um, but I do have a lot of, like, German, like, culture within me and stuff, like, so it's honestly really exciting to see both a England player and also a German player. It's really cool to see both, and, uh, yeah, so the Hurricane outfit includes the Hurricane emote and back bling, also called Hurricane. And uh, the back bling is the only thing we've actually been able to look at other than the skin itself. And it looks alright. I don't think it really necessarily goes with the skin, but it's pretty universal generally. It will pretty much just fit with any skin that you want it to. And, you know, I think that's the least you can ask for. And honestly, I'm just glad we didn't get another football back bling because we've already got a few of those now. And then the Marco Reyes outfit includes the Marcino emote and also the Marcino back bling. We only see the back bling, and uh, I mean it's a bag. It's a it's a bag with like a football in it. It's not really that interesting, which is kind of unfortunate. But honestly, it does seem like with how Harry Kane comes with the hurricane, I I assume that the uh, back blings were probably chosen by the actual players. Which, if that's what they wanted, fair enough. I don't see an issue with it. The blog post goes on to say Fortnite UA for Euro 2020 Cup. After some friendly competition to start Chapter 2 Season 7, the real competition heats up with the Fortnite UEFA Euro 2020 Cup starting June 16th, 2021. Compete for the opportunity to earn prize money as well as in-game cosmetic rewards. We do actually know what they are now, so we kind of knew what the names of them were. It was the Kick It and Winner's Cup um, cosmetics, but now we actually know that the Kick It is a spray and the Winner's Cup is an emoticon, it's pretty much what I said in the last video because it's pretty predictable what it's going to be. Um, yeah, some people were thinking that it was going to be an emote. It's not. It's kind of a shame, but I'm not really surprised. And at the end of the day, it's more free stuff. You can't really say no to it. The blog then goes on to say that the Fortnite UEFA Euro 2020 Cup will span two days with one round each day. Round one will be open to all eligible players as further described in the Fortnite UEFA Euro 2020 Cup official rules. The top performing players from round one will advance to round two. You can see the breakdown per region below. And that breakdown is that Europe, NA East, NA West, and Brazil is the top thousand. And then Middle East, Asia, and Oceania is the top 500. And at the conclusion of round two, the top performing players in each region will earn a share of the $50,000 prize pool. Additionally, all players will earn at least 10 points and receive the winner's cup emoticon. And all players who earn at least 20 points will receive the Kick It Spray. And in order to participate, you'll need to have your Epic account at level 30, as well as have two-factor authentication enabled on your Epic account. And then it just goes on to say, to get full tournament details and requirements, please be sure to read the Fortnite UEFA Euro 2020 Cup official rules. And that is the entire blog post. So overall, we don't get too much information on what specifically the type of cup is going to be. Though, at this point, with how they're promoting it, I'd say it's more likely to actually be a true Battle Royale, just standard, um, you know, 
arena style tournament compared to what I was thinking, which would be a creative tournament. It's still possible. We don't have the like specific details quite yet, but at the end of the day, I don't really mind either way. Having 20 points be the total you need for the two items that are free, I think is reasonable. 20 points is pretty easy to reach, especially if it's going to be 8 to 10 matches or rounds, whatever, that you're able to play for it, like most tournaments are. So, overall, I think it's actually a pretty good tournament. I'm very excited to get the skins, the Icon Series skins. Um, honestly, Kane and Reyes, I'm, I'm so excited. They look so cool, and... I don't usually say that about football skins or sports skins in general, but honestly, I'm so excited. Far more than I ever was about Neymar Jr. You know, having Harry Kane and, and uh, Marco Reyes, it's just, it's, it's so cool. It's so very cool. But in any case, that's going to be everything for this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, like it, subscribe now and here. Tell me what you think of the skins and also what you think of the new information about the tournament. And, uh... If I remember, I will put the link to the blog in the description below so you can check out all the links and all the official rules and stuff like that. But in any case, that's it from me, and uh, yeah. Bye! Luna Rainbow Flag, Happy Pride, Rabbit with Facts, Streamer Let's Play, Dave them out like dinosaurs, FNAFN, Troll, not the leader of a cult, Rabbit with Facts, it's Luna.